launching the flight was the Civil Aviation Authority in Kajansi, headed to Arua. The flights will target tourists and businesses in the neighboring Sudan and Congo. With over 11,000 passenger traffic, the Civil Aviation Authority says the flights will increase the traffic. We are sure that with Bar Aviation commencing these flights, this domestic passenger traffic is going to be increased. We also know that Arua is one of the five designated uh, aerodromes for international entry and exit. Viani Luja, who is the Civil Aviation Authority spokesperson, says tourists can now fly in from any destination in East Africa direct to Arua if migration arrangements are facilitated in time. It means that in the East African tourism circuit, tourists, for instance, can be flown from any East African tourist destination direct to Arua if arrangements for customs and immigration are made in advance. There was a gap in this route, but now we are so happy that we'll be bridging that gap in uh, building our domestic tourism and, bus and uh, domestic business. Bar Aviation says it will three times fly to Arua and will increase the traffic if need arises. Bar Aviation will be going to Arua every Monday, Tuesday and Friday. We take off from at, at Kajansi at 8 o'clock, land at 9.30, so that flight takes only one and a half hours. However, the area leaders have asked the government to consider improving the roads to the airfield in order to attract more businesses. Kuvolu gudolu vila dalai kajansi kutao, okutuo kakuchisawe echi okubili, katichino cha akusatu. Nisaba central government, esewo, sente zenja ulumubu wangu, uwe chitalu. Balabenti ngudezo zikuru watamaka. Tuvemu bine biachi, ibiya maramu. Kamana Ivan Walunyolo, NTV Inetebe.